Manchester United versus Chelsea. Manchester United 2.7, Chelsea 2.75 and draw 3.3. Now, uh, when I started um, researching this game, I was thinking to myself, got to go with Chelsea. Manchester United, poor form. But Manchester United have not lost on their home turf since the 27th of August, and that was at Spurs. So, really, I actually think that the play here is Manchester United draw no bet at 1.97. I think, I, I'm, well, I'm hoping the worst they're going to do is draw. I've gone for the draw at 3.3, and I'd go one step further and think it could be a nil-nil. Yeah. I really do. Yeah. Uh, I really I really think that we could see a complete and utter stalemate in this game. So uh, when we say that, that doesn't stop people from just going under 2.5 mm. or both teams to score. No. Um, I, I just I just like 3.3, the draw. Yeah. I told you that inside that we would be on the draw no bets when you because I am not as I am not as confident as you, Flash. I need that's I need I need to get some confidence with those draws. And that's why I did the draw no bet, you see. 1.97 Manchester United. I was really surprised. That was not I, I immediately so when I start like, like capping the games and things, I I I I almost have a bet in mind. And then until like I, I do the research and things, and then I'm either talked out of it or into it. And and I was I was like Chelsea, let's take Chelsea. Um, but no, I was kind of leaning towards Manchester United. I think they could get something out of this. The other thing is though, Nat, and then mm-hmm. we've we've said this all year as well for people, and I hope that they've done it at some stages, is that if you bat the draw, then you, you all right, most of our bets are 90 minutes, but if you bet the draw and it's a draw after 70, 75 minutes, then you're getting a 75 minute winner. Yeah. And you can cash out. And just leave, and, and and you've done. And who cares? All the amount of late goals in the Premier League that we could. I mean, listen, I've been done a few times, but I have cashed out a few times this year, and I would have got done. Mm, yeah. No, I know. Unfortunately, obviously, we don't do like live in play like betting videos. Um, you know, so no. yeah, it's it's always it's always a good thing. I suppose we can share because obviously we do it a, a few days um, in advance. Um, so yeah. yeah, it's always good to sort of advise that because obviously the tips that attract on on our record unless we can work out a way that you know we basically say if by the 80th minute or something or you do a twitter well, post no. then we can reflect that in our results no yeah something. well i've done i've done both of them things but they've also got to understand that the individual they're following i mean anyone who follows me on this on this show knows that if i've if i've said it's going to be tight it's going to be a draw they're almost if it's a draw after 80 minutes they can almost know that i'm out I'm yeah. gone. Or if I've or if I've done a team at say five, uh, and they're winning with ten minutes to go, but they're only winning by one goal, mm. I'm gone again. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Manchester United double chance. There can't be enough odds on that. One. Is that uh, Tuniskov just said Manchester United double chance? I don't think that they, there's going to be a lot of value in that one. 